Welcome to another in our series of videos celebrating the recipients of the 2019 and 2020 ACM Awards. This video celebrates the recipients of the Software System Award. The Software System Award recognizes an institution or individuals who have developed a software system of lasting influence on computing. This award has a $35,000 prize provided by IBM. The 2019 recipient of the Software System Award is Paul Macapetris, ThreatStop Inc. We honor him for his development of DNS, the domain name system. The TCP IP based internet, first deployed in the early 1980s, relied on a centrally managed host text file to map host names to their IP addresses. The file was updated manually and sent daily to all internet sites. Paul Makapetris devised a bold but simple plan to create the first stable operational domain name system. I think the best engineering is something that allows people in the future to do whatever they want. And so you can't really foresee all of the uses. Makapetris single authored the DNS specification and developed Jeeves, the first DNS server implementation. Throughout the 1980s, he advanced the concept by revising the DNS specification, broadening the scope of DNS, and playing a key role in helping others deploy it. 30 years ago when I created the DNS, I purposely made it very extensible. My work was about 100 pages of the foundation and first floor of this building, and since then there's thousands of pages of standards that are built on top of it. DNS expanded dramatically in scale and function thanks to the architecture created by Paul Makapetris. It now manages over 350 million separately managed domains that respond to tens of billions of queries every day. The 2020 Software System Award honors the team of Margot Seltzer, University of British Columbia, Michael Allen Olson, Cloudera, and Keith Bostick, MongoDB. They created the NoSQL movement and pioneered the dual approach to open source and proprietary licensing of software. So being a not very bright graduate student, I got sucked into building a new hash implementation. The person doing that was Keith Bostick, who had an ulterior motive. Simultaneously, Mike Olson was my office mate. In the early 1990s at UC Berkeley, PhD student Margot Seltzer, master's student Mike Olson, and Berkeley staff member Keith Bostick created Berkeley DB as an open source software package. Seltzer and Bostick then founded Sleepy Cat Software to further develop Berkeley DB and provide commercial support. In 1997, Mike Olson joined them. And we figured, okay, we want to build this software. We know exactly what we want to build. We'll build it. Yeah. And lo and behold, other people bought it too. For the next decade, Berkeley DB became the de facto data store for major web infrastructure. As the first production quality and commercial key value store, it helped launch the NoSQL movement. Sleepy Cat also pioneered the dual license model to license software. Use and redistribution in open source applications were free, or companies could get a commercial license for support or distribute Berkeley DB as part of proprietary packages. Thanks to Margot Seltzer, Mike Olson, and Keith Bostick, Berkeley DB would become a powerful, reliable, long-lived software package. Our warmest congratulations to the recipients of the 2019 and 2020 Software System Award. Thank you for watching.